Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreak.com coming at you with Jaspie's Hockey Heating Up 13 box mixer, random team break, featuring a hip parade hockey break uh, box case that is platinum edition. So it usually goes, I think like limited is the base edition, then it goes platinum, then sapphire. So this is, this is a, a nice tier above the limited edition. Then we got Pro Set, uh, Series 1, and a box of 2020-2021 Allure. Very big thanks to everybody here. Thank you to the people who bought spots straight up. A lot of you did. Most of you did. And thanks to the people who took a chance on that filler pack. Congrats again to the winners right there. And all 31 hockey teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Four and a six, ten times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. We got Mike Grzynski down to Martin Doring. After 10, four and a six, 10 times for the teams. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. After ten, we got the Vancouver Canucks down to the Buffalo Sabres. Buffalo! All right, Mike G, Canucks. Tana with the Maple Leaves. Brian B with the Flyers. Mac, you got the Oilers. Steve with the Blue Jackets. Martin with the Stars. Brian H with the Lightning. Martin with the Red Wings and Senators. Jonathan with the Devils. Martin with the Blackhawks. Carl with the Caps. Kevin with the Avs. Uh, Jonathan M with the Blues. Sean Maddock with the Predators. Matthew with the Flames. Martin with the Sharks. Craig with the Jets. Mike Tower with the Islanders. Nick L with the Hurricanes. Raymond with the Bruins. Brian with the Coyotes. Steve Birch with the uh, Ducks. Brad, you got the Canadiens. Rick T with the Penguins. Brian Croft, uh, Minnesota Wild and Florida Panthers. Wild Panthers. Martin with the Kings. Sean with the Golden Knights. Carl with the Rangers. And Martin with the Buffalo Sabres. It's alphabetized by team. I know that text is a little small there, so if you need to see your, uh, your team again, definitely let me know. I'm going to pause the video. And when we, when we come back, we're going to see, see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. Be right back. All right. Welcome back, everybody. Look at that. There was a deal done between Martin and Ray. So Martin is out of the Senator spot and into the Bruins spot. We'll put a T next there for trade. And Raymond is out of the Bruins spot and into the Ottawa Senator spot. We'll put a T next there team name for trade so we know it's so we can just keep track of it and see who draws first blood in the trade let's print that out Thanks everybody for getting into the action. Should be a fun one here. All right, so we got that 21-22 Series 1 box, 2021 Allure, the 2021 Pro Set, and then we got 10 boxes in here. Uh, hockey, Hit Parade Hockey, uh, Platinum Edition Series 8, which is what we're doing, right? S8, perfect. So we'll do, we'll save those. Let's do series one first. Looking for uh, young guns, basically. Good luck, everybody. Been watching a little more hockey lately. Trying to, anyway. So 
So hopefully by some sort of osmosis, I'll, I'll learn some of these, you know, get better at learning all these hockey, learning all this hockey. I think hockey playoffs are going to be happening uh, happening soon, right? Yeah, I heard that. J Dog, Jason Jaspi read out a tweet from uh, John Morosi that the Dodgers and Freddie Freeman are working on a contract, getting really close, possibly announced tonight. I won't believe it until it's official, though, because, you know, there could be. There could be, I don't know, a secret team that swoops in. Remember when, uh, remember when the Padres thought they were getting Max Scherzer? And then the Dodgers swooped in? Well, I, I mean, who knows if he's getting six years? The Dodgers were always talking about, were, were always... In, in at four years, but a higher average annual value. But what was the report? Did they say five or six? I don't think the Dodgers would have gone to seven. Not at that price point. Which I kind of like that strategy. If you're able to, to sort of pay a higher average annual value but not get locked into the, the years. You know, I think that works. There's Mackenzie Wegar to 199. Here's Uko Pekka Lukonen, Young Guns. So sorry, I know this is a hockey break, but obviously a lot of baseball news happening here. So as of 10.09 Central Time, according to MLBTradeRumors.com, a deal that would guarantee around 150. Moroz, John Morosi now adding the deal may exceed $150 million. So either they're adding years or they're adding, they're adding to the, uh, to the yearly average annual value. There's Brinson Pashidnik. Pashidnik. Young Guns for the Sharks. I'm gonna have trouble with that. Martin with that one. Alexi Lefrenier for the Rangers. That'll be for Carl. Well, are we shipping all cards in this? Yeah, all cards ship. Pesai Shunk? Pesai Shunk? Yeah, no, that's, I'm going to have to hear it from somebody on, on the broadcast or something like that. And we've got a Upper Deck Game jersey. Mark Giordano for the Flames. Calgary. 
That'll be for Matthew. You know, I don't know. I don't know if Jason's listening. If J Jason, Jaspi, if you're listening, the Kings in on any 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 deals? I think the hockey trade deadline is getting pretty close too. Brandon's saying, man, if Freeman does become a Dodger, you're finally gonna have a favorite position player. Hershon Bueller, all your favorites, but they're, but they're pitchers. Yeah, Dodgers a Dodgers edition. Freddie Freeman would be pretty nice. Although I'm not gonna get ahead of myself. I'm gonna wait until. Uh, you know, wait until we get some official confirmation. Now, Ken Rosenthal is reporting. This is breaking news, right? Ken Rosenthal is reporting from the Athletic. Six-year, one sixty is po is the possible deal for Freddie Freeman. That's about twenty-six point six million dollars a year. I mean, I think he was expecting a little bit more than that, right? There's Tanner Genot from Nashville, Upper Deck Canvas Young Guns. I like that font. That looks really cool. That's for uh, Nashville. That's going to go to Sean Maddock. There's Keaton Middleton for the Avs, who took care of my Kings the other night. It's kind of a cool insert as well. Kevin with the abs. All right, and for the Buffalo Sabres, Martin, you get the Michael Hauser Young Guns. So hopefully all those Young Guns that we pulled turn into monsters. All right, let's see what we got in our lure box here. Michael Losio, what's going on? Blue Jays going to the World Series, sticking with his prediction. And Vladdy winning the Triple Crown and MVP. Brandon saying Blue Jays lack the pitching. Connor is going to. Connor is saying Tigers are going to surprise everyone this year. Does Torkelson get called up this year? Also, J Dog mentioned this earlier in the chat, but yeah, I really wish I really wish Dodgers had a chance of getting Jock Peterson back on on the squad. It'd be be a great DH. It'll be also be weird seeing the DH in the NL this year. There's Steven Stomkos, Black Rainbow, and our first autograph is Nick Suzuki. Iced out autograph for the Montreal Canadiens. That'll be for Brad. Last spot mojo. Strikes again. 70% of the time, 100% of the time. So they say. And there's rookie Alexis Lafreniere. How's he been doing this season? Is he, is he doing things that are good for the hobby, Lafreniere? And we've 
Scott, Huberto, Red Rainbow, and Tim Lejegren. 13 out of 99 green quartz for Toronto. Tana with Toronto. Orange Slice. Die cut. Jean Gabriel Pigot for the Islanders. That's going to go to Mike Tower. And the relic is going to be for the Dallas Stars, Jay Godinger. That'll be for Martin and Dallas. See what we got in here. Pro set, two autographs plus two original buyback cards per box. All right, we got Mario Lemieux for the Penguins. Nice, I've heard of him. Rick T with Pittsburgh. We got Luke Robitaille, nice. Oh, also that Mario Lemieux is five out of five all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Can't show you a train whistle, Rick. And for my Kings, three out of five, Luke Robitaille. That'll be for Martin and the Kings all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And we've got a dual autograph. Four out of five. Mark Messier and Grant Fuhr. Four out of five, both Rangers. Pro set champions. Carl with New York. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And who do we have here? A five out of five, Vincent Damphouse. Who is for that team right there? He played for um, <laughs> I don't know who he's played for. Wait, no, is that for Edmonton? Wait, oh, 1987-88. So what team was that? Sorry, I just jumped the gun with the Rangers. Oh, he won the cup with the Oilers in 87. along with Grant Fuhr for the Oilers. My bad. So uh, my apologies to Carl and the Rangers. Um, this is for Mac and the Oilers. Mac, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Right, and it has the year right there. I, I have no idea where this goes. Let me consult Jason really quick. Maybe we'll not put these in mixers anymore. Is there a checklist for this?
Well, he was a Maple Leaf, an Oiler, a Canadian, a Shark. That's definitely not a Shark jersey, right? Catch Me is saying Montreal. I think he was also a different number on Montreal. His number 10 on Montreal. Or number 10 on Toronto. He was 21 for the Oilers. And 25 for the Canadiens. All right. Sorry, thanks guys. Yeah, you, Nick, catch me all, all confirming the research. So that'll be for Brad and the Canadiens. All right, so that is for Brad, last spot mojo. And five, out of fives under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! All right, thanks for your help, everybody. Appreciate that, all right. Now, what should be some pretty nice stuff in here. See a lot of good stuff in here. Platinum edition. All right, first one out of the gate is going to be for the St. Louis Blues, 94 out of 99, three color patch and autograph. That's Vladimir Tarasenko. Jonathan with, uh, with St. Louis. That's from uh, Old Panini Dominion Hockey. Rookie patch and autograph. What year is that? So that's 2013-14. Nice start. We have another rookie card, Mark Stone. For the Ottawa Senators, that's Raymond drawing first blood in the trade. Next up is, oh, nice patch. This is from uh, Cup Hockey, Limited Logos. Mark Giordano, 20 out of 50. Calgary, that'll be for Matthew in the Calgary Flames. Good luck, everybody. Next one is from Goodwin Champions, Mitch Marner for the Toronto Maple Leafs. That's Tana and Toronto. From 2018. Next box. There's some Jack Hughes for New Jersey. Nice. Uh, debut ticket access autographs, Jack Hughes. 
from 1920 Upper Deck Credentials Hockey. New Jersey, that's going to be for Jonathan and the Devils. Getting some try to trade, couldn't trade mojo maybe? All right. Next up is Jake Gunsel. 22 out of 99 for the Pittsburgh Penguins. That's going to be for Rick. Oh, yeah. Did I miss the number on the Hughes? Oh, there it is up there. 55 out of 65. Thanks, Mike. Uh, this, this, Joseph, is a 13-box uh, hockey mixer. It was 100 bucks a spot. Got limited logos, Tyler uh, Seguin for the Bruins, 16 out of 50. So I guess a hit each for the traded teams, Martin with the Bruins on the other side of that trade. A few more to go. We got a Nick Suzuki chronology autograph right on the card there for Montreal. That's for Brad and the Canadiens. All right, two more boxes to go, fingers crossed. We have a Igor Shersteken for the New York Rangers. That one's for Carl. There you go, Carl. Got you on the board. And the last box, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. The last one is going to be for the Avs, that's Future Watch autograph. Kale McCarr, 287 at 399. Watched him uh, beat my Kings yesterday. That goes to Colorado. That'll be for Kevin and the Colorado Avalanche. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I will see you next time for the next one. Do I, have, do I have to give away anything at the end? No, just a nice clean break, start to finish. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for the next hockey break. Bye-bye.